And what is up, everyone? It's the All Gaming Blog here, bringing you Mario's two ways to victory. Um, I've played this game fair. I mean, I didn't really play this game too much, to be quite honest. Uh, Mario was leaving the dinosaur land, but his ship was attacked by Bowser in the way, and the princess was taken. Mario must now rescue her. Uh, there's no punctuation there, other than a period at the end, so that's not very good. So yeah, this is my uh, latest playthrough now. Let's go to the Undersea Cave, the first real level, and yeah, I'm gonna use save states. Hopefully I will not need them too much, or I won't need to spam them too much. Uh, because I think I'm, I'm a, I mean, I'm not the greatest player ever, for the contrary, I'm just mediocre at best. But, um, I'm not that bad of a player either, so I don't really spam save states too much. However, I need to play some... See? Like that, I just died. Uh, however, I feel like I need to play some frequently, even if I don't use them, because it's it's always good. I don't want to have to restart the entire level just because of one stupid mistake or whatever. So yeah, I've played this game a little bit uh, prior to recording, of course, you know, so I know it's a good hack or if it's worth me doing. And it's progressively hard, and I mean, it's not too hard of a hack. By all means, it's, it's nothing out of the other world, but it's a bit difficult and um, it, it's getting progressively harder actually there's nothing on that pipe in case you're wondering that's why I'm not even going and it's progressively getting harder now and I don't know I mean this is what happens with ha with some sometimes with these hacks like I start them but then they get so hard to the point I just don't want to do them anymore and I got hit it's okay though to the point I just don't really want to do them anymore so I don't know if it's gonna happen with this one I hope not I hope I finish this hack which I have finished a couple of, of uh, Super Mario Realm hacks. Hopefully I'll finish this one too. If not, then oh well, at least I'll try to give you guys as much as I can. Uh, yeah, let me just continue on. So I don't like when I'm small Mario, because as you can see I just died there. You can die very easily. And let me just throw that up there and get a mushroom. So it's always, for me, it's always good for me to have like one mushroom at least. And yeah, so even if I get hit, I'll just lose the mushroom. Oh, see, God damn it. I don't want to lose that mushroom that stupidly, but I'm not going to like retry. Wow, really? I'm not going to like retry every time I lose my mushroom, so that that'd be just stupid. Now, the game isn't that particularly that hard, but what makes it harder for me is that I'm playing it with an Xbox 360 controller. And if you really, and if you guys know, as you can see, I, I fail a lot of platforming. And uh, an Xbox 360 controller is not ideal for platforming, it's actually really, really bad. So if you guys play uh, like any platforming game like Super Mario or whatever with an Xbox 360 controller, then you have my eternal respect, sir, because it is freaking hard, trust me. Like this jump, for example, I'm gonna take like three or four tries to do this simple jump because this analog stick is horrible. And not just the analog stick, but it, the, the control is just not very good. I got it for years though, and uh, I don't have an Xbox 360. I just have the controller, a wired one, because I got it for uh, to play games on the PC. Now the games I was playing with the controller was like um, I don't know, like normal games like Prince of Persia and whatever when it was out there, and uh, other types of not really platforming games, but uh, other types of, of PC games that keyboard and mouse just don't do what well, really just don't do justice to it. So. Hopefully you guys won't. Uh, hopefully I won't make too many mistakes, and you guys don't have to see me retry the same crap over and over, and over again. But expect to see some state reloads and some mistakes for made for my part, just because I'm not really the greatest Super Mario World hack player, anyways. Uh, don't claim to be, and yeah. Let's see if I can. Ooh, I got some some bonus. I don't know. Let me jump. Uh, there we go. So yeah, guys, I don't know how long this episode should be. I think about 12 minutes per episode should be sufficient enough. This is gonna be like a trip jump, trick jump rather, and see if I can. Nope. Oh god damn it! Oh, there we go. Second try. That's that could be harder than it looks, but it's not really that hard. Um, you stay there, fish. Or fishes, because it's way more than one. Oh, there we go. Kill them both. And kill the third one. Now, at this part, I thought like the, the coin bo boxes were gonna be all over the place, but no, it's just. Uh, can I? Oh, crap. 
Okay, that's not what I wanted to do, but it, it's all good. I don't even care anymore. So, so far the game is actually pretty generous with uh, fire flowers and mushrooms because I know there are tons of ROM hacks out there that do not even use. But really? There are tons of ROM hacks that don't. I just don't even care. I'm just gonna take the hit and move on with my life. What? Really? Really? Did I really need to lose all of my. Oh, I don't even care. Uh, like I was saying, there's ROM hacks that don't really use mushrooms and uh, fire flowers or capes or whatever too much. If the feature is in the game, use it. That's a tip to all Super Mario. Oh, that was lovely. That's a big tip from me to all Super Mario ROM hackers out there. I'm not even gonna take that one, and I'll show you why. Because there's gonna be another one here, and if I grab it, like this, and if I cross it, it will turn into a mushroom. So yeah, I'm gonna try to make as many levels as I can. I will also do secret exits and uh, all that good stuff, which I think is gonna be one right next. Now I'm gonna do this, the secret exit, no, normal exits first, the secret exit after. Because secret ex exits are usually shorter. So let's go for it and let's read what's in this box. Uh, if you ever see a purple door, it's a reset door. Don't enter these doors unless you need to reset the area. I'll keep that in mind, but that's good to know, that's good to know. Uh, really? I already lost my mushroom. What's in here? Uh, oh yeah, I gotta go up there. Alright, what's up here? Oh, another mushroom. That's nice, that's nice. Jumping on these musical notes boxes. And moving on with the level. Uh, if you guys are wondering, no, I'm not gonna stop making Call of Duty videos, I'm just gonna make less of them because my quality is crap. Oh, there's a choice now, you can choose this path or this one. I'll choose this one for now, for the real exit, and the other one for the secret exits. That way, because I'm gonna, make the, gonna be on this level twice anyway, so I might as well just show you guys. This one is harder than the other one though. And there's a Yo but you get a Yoshi though. I don't, and I'm not sure if you get to keep it or if you're gonna have to discard it or whatever. I can't remember really, but we got a Yoshi regardless. And uh, yeah, get to press this. And although you have a timer to like, but the, the time is too much. The path isn't that long, and it's as you can see already done. It's easy, easy peasy, and kill off these guys before they throw in more. Oh no, Yoshi! No, I want my Yoshi. Uh, I'm not. I shouldn't like reset every time I like, lose my Yoshi, cause it might happen more than once though. But yeah, I don't want to lose my Yoshi. So let's go. And uh, the reason why I'm say, what really? I'm not gonna eat you plants. The reason I'm safe stating so much, is cause I'm playing this on uh, SNES 9X. I hope I pronounced that correctly. So there is no rewind button like there is on the other Nintendo Super Nintendo emulator that I'm used to use. However, I cannot record for the life of me on the other emulator, so I gotta use this one. This is the normal exit for you guys. So I gotta use this one and I gotta use uh, SNES 9X, which is, although uh, most people will definitely prefer this one, I like the other one better. The ZSNES, I think it's called. Uh, I prefer the other one better. This is a normal one to the Aegis Castle. Now I'm gonna do the secret exit here and I think that's gonna be it for this video. Seeing that it's only the first one and I'm redoing... Like, I should probably just cut to the chase on this level but I mean I don't know. I'm gonna redo the, the entire level because I think it's more fun. Whoa. Oh yeah I gotta discard my Yoshi now. Oh well. Oh well. It was fun while I had him. It was fun while I had my Yoshi. Don't need a Yoshi now. Whoa, whoa, whoa mushroom. You might be asked, well, why are you running around a mushroom if you already have one? Well, I need it on that box just in case. Because, yeah. I'm, I'm very... Not the greatest player in the world. Let's just leave it at that. Let's just throw that here. Oh, yeah, kill one. And we'll most likely kill myself now. Let's go through this path for the secret exits because the normal exit is just too boring. Now if you go here, there is a fire flower, and there, there's the key, in case you didn't know already. Let me get it, and I, there's like a tiny hole, there's like tons of space in the tiny hole, and I fell right through the tiny hole. Like, it's like I was aiming for it, except I wasn't, which is ridiculous, oh well. Um, I don't want to save state too much, so let's just move on with this. And I'm gonna. Oh, thought I was gonna hit it there. 
Oh, uh, I didn't even kill the little... Uh, okay. So let's move on with this. Let's move on. See, dude, it's... This part is really easy, and you might think, Oh yeah, the rest of the hack is really, really easy. No, it's not. It's gonna get progressively harder. I do not accept that. It's gonna get progressively harder to the point that... Uh, yeah, I'm just not... I mean, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm, enjoy I'm enjoying it so far, and I've done a lot. But it's not the easiest hack in the world, and I don't know. Now this area should be kind of familiar to you. And let me just break that, get the key, that's it. Well that's it for the secret exit, and I don't think I'm gonna record anything. And although I could go through this path, I will do it later, because this is gonna unlock uh, two new paths, one is gonna be the star, the other one's just gonna be something I don't wanna do, so I'll just do the castle. But I'll leave you guys now and see you guys on the next video. Peace!